Heiko, Nelu, Devsiger, and Ebitz, come downstairs. We have an important announcement to tell you all. Okay, Mom and Dad. What's up? You are taking the SAT tomorrow as we already signed you up. What? Why didn't you tell us in advance? We need time to study. You can study right now if you want. How? Go on Kino Academy and look up SAT practice tests. You can choose between reading, writing and language, math with no calculator, and math with calculator. On the test, you will have all of them, but if there's one subject you struggle more in, take more tests on that one. For the first few times, take it without time. As you get better, time it. On the real test, it will be split into four parts, and you will have 60 minutes for reading, 35 minutes for writing, 25 minutes for math with no calculator, and 45 minutes for math with calculator. Man. This sucks. Now we have to spend all day studying for a stupid test. At least our parents are smart enough to know a site where you can study for it. Is anyone as tired and dozed off as I am? I am, totally. Wait a minute. We don't have to study now. We can just study later. Oh my god, Nailuj you're a genius. Let's play some Among Us. Good morning everyone. Welcome to the SAT test. Before we begin, we must go over all the rules. You may not have any electronics with you, such as cell phones, MP3 players, laptops, iPads, tablets, headphones, smartwatches, all that crap, so if you have any, please put them somewhere in the back of the room. Okay, perfect. Now I will pass out the tests and wait for me before we begin. Okay, now that your tests are passed out, I need you to fill out all the info on the answer sheet. Bubble the letters and write your name, address, city, state, zip code, the book codes, and anything else it tells you to write. One more rule guys. You may only work on the section we are all working on. For example, if we're on reading, you may only work on reading. Do not turn to writing and language, or math, with or without calculator. Speaking of math, there are two sections, one without the calculator, and one with the calculator. You may only use your calculator on the last section. You may not use it during the other sections. Speaking of which, your calculators must be acceptable ones. Most scientific, such as the Casio ones, as well as graphing, such as Texas Instruments, TI-84+, are acceptable. Can everyone just show me their calculators so I can see if they're appropriate ones? Okay, perfect. Now please put them down. Now please turn the SAT page to the reading section. One more thing. It's okay to guess. No penalty if you get an answer wrong. Anyway, now that we're starting the test, it's time to start the time. This is the reading section. There will be a bunch of articles that you have to read and questions that go along with each one. Some will also include charts, graphs, etc. You are allowed and recommended to underline and annotate to take notes and to help you answer the questions. We will have 65 minutes to complete this section. Right now it is 8.35, so we will do this section until 9.40. The timer is on, voices are off, and begin. All right. Time is up. Take a break, get up, walk around, relax, have a snack, have a drink, go to the bathroom, or whatever you need to do. But absolutely no phones or other electronics. It will still be considered cheating and you will immediately have to leave. So yeah. Take a break. Oh my god. I can't believe we just snuck into this closet. 
Let's go copy down the answers right now. Boys, you four have cheated. You just cheated. That's it, your score is getting cancelled, and you are forbidden to take this test in future. Go home right now while I call your parents. You idiotic not so gentleman. We can't believe you cheated on the SAT by sneaking into the answers room. Now you'll never be able to take it in the future. You were so grounded until Fox and Nick really rule graduates from high school. Get your asses upstairs to your rooms right now while we confiscate your computers. We promise we'll do something in the future. Hey guys. I hope all is well throughout President's Day weekend, or February break if you get a full week off like I do. I just want to say, I'm really sorry for not making any videos in such a long time. I've been incredibly busy with so much other stuff. I am in 11th grade in high school, which is a busy year for me because the work is harder. I need to find community service opportunities as I couldn't do any last year due to COVID, and I still need to make time to do things like walks and play video games. More importantly, I've been super duper busy looking at colleges, and I'm getting flooded with emails and mail from colleges. Soon they're gonna fill up my data on my computer and phone. I've been visiting some of them, both in person and virtually. Sometimes it's a bit of a long drive there and back. And often, I like to get places myself because I'm learning to do things independently. On top of all that, 2022's been an amazing year for me. I've been doing a lot of fun stuff at school, such as talking on the microphone at games, spectating games, tapping on the wrestling referees with a special soft tool, and sometimes controlling the scoreboard. I've also been working out at my gym. I've been growing big muscles as a result. Another great thing is that many people are stopping to care about mask policies. Even at school, many teachers don't really care about masks anymore. I live on the east coast of the United States, and COVID cases have been decreasing ever since. I have a good feeling that masks will be optional worldwide somewhere around this year, but at the same time, I have no idea where COVID will go next, whether it's cause a more contagious and or deadly variant or just get less and less severe and become more of an endemic virus like a cold or the flu. But whatever we do, we have to live in the present moment, let the past go, and leave the future unknown. It's totally up to all of us in the whole wide world to make 2022 a better year, as well as stop the COVID virus. Anyway, this is Fox and Nick Really Rule signing off. Please be sure to like and subscribe and stay notified if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time.